Hello everyone, this is KJ. Welcome back to Survive Alive. We're in No Man's Sky today. Uh, we are going to portal to a couple of places and uh, drop a couple of base computers. You know what? I do this every single time. I need to have the portal address. <laughs> so, uh, this one, uh, this first one is going to be uh, slightly complicated. Uh, we are going to portal to a system uh, where there's a freighter that we want to look at. Um, in order to see that freighter, we're going to have to warp away and warp back, but it is time for my freighter battle. So we're going to do something slightly sneaky, but it's, it's only very slightly sneaky. Where's the fish? <laughs> da, 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 da. This is taking me forever because the print is super small. Uh, I could try reading more than one glyph at a time. Moon TP TP. Moon TP TP. Um, Pi. Uh, Triforce and Shippo. Shippo, where are you? There it is. <laughs> so that is the portal address for the Iderican freighter. The star system we're going to is called Naukra. The star system we're putting a base in is next door in an uncharted system. And then uh, after we do that, we will uh, go to the location of the fighter that I want, the Agoya Bio's hand. Eventually, I don't have enough money for the freighter. I might have enough for the fighter, uh, but the fighter is super hard to get. Actory got Malkra system. Welcome to it. Thank you, Lava. <laughs> All right, so there won't be a freighter battle right now, but if we go zoomy. Let's find the uncharted system. We're going to change to um, uh, economy. And we are going to go to a nearby white star. If I can find a nearby white star. Do I have it on the wrong filter? <laughs> uh, I'm sure it's closer than this. Is that it? No. All right, let's try not putting it on economy. Let's try using our heads and putting it on life form like you're supposed to. <laughs> I don't know why my brain just stopped right there. Uh, 123 light years. Uh, 136 light years. 64 light years. There we go. I don't know why my brain said that. Go to economy. Duh. Mistakes were made. Indeed. All right. Let's see here. We need a base. A mechanical planet. That might be fun. Let's go there. <laughs> we could have just gone to a red, looked at red colored stars and probably found an uncharted system pretty quickly. I'm still having whiplash from my brain fart. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to drop a base computer. And Claymo. There we go. <laughs> Uh, 
And let's call this next door, next door to true Nautra. I almost put LOL on there. <laughs> All right, now we're going to warp back to Nautra. And uh, we should see the freighter. If we don't, I quit. <laughs> Because that would just be too much. I don't think I warped. Or <laughs> should have put a base computer in Naukra too. Make it easier to find. There it is. <laughs> I think I might just do that. Drop a base computer in Naukra too. I do have one on normal mode. I just ferried lava there the other day. <laughs> Uh, last week's live stream was uh, like the day after. There she is. We'll go ahead and fight it. Because we have a save in the other system. I don't have the money to buy this ship, so... Honestly, we already have an S-Class freighter. So now taking an A-Class or lower class freighter would just be um, silly. So we're going to need some money. Trading because it's cool looking, all those guns going off. Oops, I missed a very rare uh, miss. That's for all of you who say that the rockets auto target. <laughs> oh, look, all the guns. <laughs> rockets do not auto target, you do have to be somewhere near <laughs> your target. Oh, this bottom. See, the bottom is so nice that I thought it was the top. <laughs> I'm using the drift. The first time that they, when they first put drift into the game, I think it was the Beyond update, I just went nuts with that. <laughs> I just... Oh my god, Every I got every one of my fighters out <laughs> to see which one would do it the best. Where the hell am I going? Yeah, first one is C-25. So we'll drop a base computer here and uh, go visit the space station. And uh, there was a multi-tool here, but I, I don't know um, what exactly has happened with it. Maybe Sean will come here and <laughs> look for it. <laughs> uh, let's see. Where'd it go? There it is. We'll just go there. The uh, systems, the system from yesterday was, ugh, it was horrid. And then uh, after that, I reloaded in three different star systems for A-class cabinets and. They were all just awful. <laughs> there wasn't even a planet that was redeemable in any of them. And uh, I guess, I don't, I hate to say that's survival mode because I haven't had this experience for a while. It's kind of a cool filter here. Let's see what it looks like. Greenish a little bit. There was something on the starship trails. Oh, look at the clouds, yeah. Chromatic filter. That's pretty cool. All right, let's drop a base now that says Naukra. And then we will uh, go to uh, where Agoya Bio's hand, the, the fighter is. 
Uh, name it. <laughs> Derpy derp. No crawl. Grief. Oh, come on. Really? That's not enough to launch? Oh, we need to get launch system upgrades. <laughs> Yesterday, we were supposed to do something completely different. I think it was this. And um, I ended up getting pulse engine upgrades and <laughs> playing with the multi-tool. <laughs> I did do some more work on the multi-tool. I got uh, plus three damage, but it's shots uh, per burst instead of clip size. And yeah, but it is plus three damage. Oh, hostile scan detected. Not happening, suit lady. Got stuff to do. I can't even see my timer right now. Sorry about the pause. <laughs> Warning, pause. <laughs> Now we need to tell a portal back to the um, portal. Lots of dead people here <laughs> every time I come here. And uh, for some reason, when Lava got back here after we were out of multiplayer, uh, there either wasn't a dead guy here or he couldn't get the location. Uh, yeah, my base is second most, third most recent base. There it is. Now, oh, I did not take a picture, but what I did do was upload this base, <clears throat> so it automatically took a picture. You can also intentionally take a picture, and those are usually <laughs> nicer. <laughs> I have a base on one save that's basically a picture of a cave wall. <laughs> There's no, nothing on the cave wall. It's just cave wall. <laughs> nice picture. Oh, look at my shippo. Shippo? What are you doing there? You weirdo? Uh, this end? Oh yeah, this is an airless planet. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. Now then, now I need the portal address for the other one and we will just grab that whoa got a little lag there okay here we go we have birds on tp uh pi triforce triforce yeah this is much faster uh, <laughs> fish, dragonfly, two of these things, a face, and another teepee, and that is the portal address for the uh, fighter, Agoya Bio's hand, and we will go drop a base there as well. We might even uh, find a trade post. Da, 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 da. There we go. Excuse me. Now this is a much, much different situation. With a fighter, you or any starship, you can go look for it a little bit at a time, anytime you want to. With a freighter, you're pretty much locked into a specific time. And Emerald, okay, well I can't call my freighter here. I don't need one of these boxes, do I? Nope. All right. Let's pull up a trade post first. Here's one. And we'll just drop a base computer right on the trade post. Although I find getting this ship is easier in the space station. I usually get it as an A-class and upgrade it. 
This one still needs to be upgraded, I think. Yeah, so we're down, we're already down 38,000 nanites. <laughs> Why not make it 88,000? And then I will be scrapping ships until the sun goes down. And probably later than that. <laughs> Friday. Now, some of you know I don't put base computers on trade posts uh, because trade posts aren't always there. <laughs> they are more stable than they used to be. Here we go with that. <clears throat> I keep building those little cheap uh, landing pads in the hopes that someday Hello Games will fix them. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Goya Bio's hand. That is all we need for that. And now let's go up to the space station. I guess we could look here. Nope. Just three haulers and a V-wing or whatever they call those things. M wing, weirdo wing. <laughs> and off we go. Off we go. <laughs> I did pick up a, a couple of space station missions while I was uh, looking for a uh, multi-tool. Not many, though. I'm finding it uh, pretty strange. Uh, where did I get all that from? <laughs> all right. I think that uh, if there were anything here, Lava would have already found it. That is, it is an A-class, so let's just check and see. Yeah, he's landed everywhere. <laughs> Rewu. I remember that planet. I remember it because it's funny. Oh, it's not even Rewu, it's Rowu. <laughs> What's this one? Oh, there's a hazy planet here. All right. Now we're gonna go ahead and do the reload here and wait for a few minutes because it is a long runway. And uh, then I think we'll go look at that uh, marsh because uh, I think I should have put my base there. Maybe. It depends. I'm all foggy looking. There we go. <laughs> I was blotchy. I don't know how long I can stand here. It's been three seconds already. <laughs> I don't think this is a first wave ship either. But it's worth it. And if I can just trigger it to come in, that would be cool. I'm staring at the door can't stop my character from moving. <laughs> they appear to be fidgety just like me. <laughs> okay, so the first wave is basically haulers. I could have just asked Lava before I started this video. <laughs> And a shuttle. All right, let's go check out that marsh. And uh, pretty clearly, I'm going to have to find the wave and then do the proper uh, save reload thingy properly. All right. That is, that is the planet in question. Emerald, paraffinium, and magnetized ferrite. It doesn't have uh, poop or mordite. <laughs> I 
I need to install these drives on the freighter that I have. At the very least, I need to get the um, get the blueprints for those those drives for this save. And um, unfortunately, you cannot buy those blueprints. Uh, those blueprints, you have to get the salvage frigate modules and buy them from your freighter, um, or rather, whatever, trade them for your fr for an, on your freighter. Blah. <laughs> I'm having some issues with words. Oh, I hope this looks nice. It's mountainous. Oh, that might be why I don't already have bases here. Because it's not nice. It's mountainous. I wonder what the other side of the planet looks like. People tell me all the time that the other side of these hazy planets, or these mountainous planets, are not like this. Well, oh boy, that looks weird. I've never uh, been able to disprove, <laughs> or prove, probably by the water would be better, I would imagine. We'll just take a look here. You know what? It it does look flatter. Let me turn over so I'm looking at it right. It does look flatter over here. I don't see any huge mountains at all. Well, that is trippy. Uh, that's abandoned. We'll just land out here. It's very, very foggy and rainy. Oh, there's a storm going on. A boiling fog. Indeed. Oh, it's gonna end soon. Oh, look. Wow, look at that thing. Well, let's just look at it the easy way. <laughs> wow, look at this. I mean, ignore that. <laughs> we'll turn him around. <laughs> the Metrodon, or whatever they were called, I don't remember really. There is a ram deer and a sentinel. I missed. <laughs> uh, should have fired sooner. Geck words. This planet is horrible. <laughs> is there any huts around here? Man, not even a hotel. Oh, no, that's cool. <laughs> All right, let's go quickly take care of the freighter. Where the hell is my ship -o? Oh, here it is. <laughs> we'll go quickly take care of the freighter, which I forgot to do yesterday, which sucks because that's a whole uh, day's mission that we've lost out on. We will have to go to a yellow star for that, unfortunately. There's one nearby. Oh, I thought that was a three-star system. All right, this will do. Nomia. I made the fuel for the frigates and everything, and then completely forgot to go to the freighter. If I thought that I was going to keep this freighter for a really long time, I would go ahead and spend the nanites to paint it a different color. Because <laughs> it's terrible. <laughs> Even black and white would be better. 
Did I buy a ship recently? Oh, I got rid of them, didn't I? Good job. <laughs> Don't need junk piling up in the landing bay. Hi, guys. Did you have fun? <laughs> Cash money, cash money. These little tiny amounts of cash money are supposed to be nanites. But they will never fix that. Because it's not terribly important. Oh, you're not done with me, I forgot. Sack venom, my nemesis. <laughs> I wonder how long it's going to take me to forget that you can't just take sack venom <laughs> from the ground. If you missed last uh, week's live stream, I may have accidentally just reached over and picked up some sack venom from the ground. <laughs> Is that on the live stream or was that when we were just playing? Now I can't even remember. Okay, our trade vessels are picking up and we still don't have the industrial. <laughs> Do I have any more? I have three of them. Okay. Let's see if we can pull this off. Industrial, 21 hours, 8 hours. They're the same number of stars, but this one has more opportunities to pick up stuff. Let's see. That's three... Four, five stars. And oh my god, the fuel. Never mind about the fuel. Carry on. Have fun. <laughs> All right, you guys. I have a huge mess to clean up. Uh, I got to put away a bunch of stuff and um, get some technology put on one of my bases because I really needed a, to be able to call a exocraft in Euclid and could not do it because I didn't have anything uh, put down on any of my bases in Euclid. So I got to get that done. I want to thank you all so much for coming along. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe despite my goofiness today. <laughs> if you're enjoying the content, please click the like button. And as always, have an amazing day.